Hey guys, Ilsa here. Welcome back to my channel. So I am in the mood for sweet potatoes. That's what I was cutting in my other video. Thank you guys so much for watching it and laughing with me. Um, so I'm going to remove the sweet potatoes from the pan. And in a separate pot, we're gonna. So, I don't know about you guys, but I need some comfort food in my life, and uh, yeah, so I'm gonna make some sweet potatoes, some candy yams. So, you're gonna add a half stick to your pot, let this melt down. I like to cook big and then I freeze it, I'm like the freezing queen. kind of divvy it up into small Ziploc bags and then I put it into a larger Ziploc bag and then whenever I want it I just go to the freezer and take things out as I, as I need them. So you're going to need brown sugar and you're going to need regular sugar, okay? Lower your temperature on your stove, turn it down. Just say brown sugar, okay? It was one third of brown sugar. One third of regular sugar. And you got it. It's gonna start to thicken up, so you're gonna add some of the starch water. want it to like be almost like a syrup that's gonna go over top of it okay you're gonna add some ground cinnamon some nutmeg mix Right, so my butter was frozen so I had to just pop it into the microwave or defrost and now I'm going to add it to my pot. So the first time around I added about a half stick and now I'm going to add another half stick.
So like most comfort foods, it requires a lot of butter. If you're worried about gaining weight, this may not be the recipe for you. and it's ready so now we're going to pour it over our yams So I'm gonna let that bake for about 30 to 40 minutes and we will have some candy yams ready to go. All right guys, and they are done. So this is what you wanna see. Uh, this is how you know that it's done. It's a nice golden brown and I'm gonna tear this up. Guys, I thank you so much for watching. I, I don't know if I ever shared, but I really enjoy cooking. Um, I like to look for new and different recipes and just try different things. I'm not a chef. <laughs> I don't know, really know what I'm doing, but um, when I'm, you know, watching people cook, I like to try it for myself and see how things turn out. Um, so if you are a cooking enthusiast and, you know, you're not a chef and you're not perfect um, and you feel like this channel might be something that could be useful to you, don't forget to like, comment, and of course, subscribe to the channel. All right, guys, so I'll catch you in my next video. I appreciate the love and support. It really means a lot to me. I bought some new equipment, so now I'm a little bit more hands-free and I feel like I'm really doing it. I'm like really a content creator out here. So if um, my channel interests you, uh, go ahead and uh, subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to uh, get to 60,000. Um, and uh, yeah, I, I can actually do that with your support and a like, a follow, a share, all those things. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Um, I love you and have a good one. Bye.